My name is Alan Chun. I am a gaffer in the film and video industry. And we're here today at a working green screen studio. Um, we have a lot of gear here that I will explain its purpose, uh, use, and in lighting and um, in production. Gaffer or the lighting director is in charge of the lighting and most electrical problems on a set. Um, so he needs to know what the equipment does and how to use it. Uh, we have a few things here today um, that I'll go over. We have a grip box with some grip gear in it. We have a location um, lighting kit, typically three to four items. Uh, we have a Fresnel light fixture. We have a fluorescent light fixture. And a, another um, tungsten fixture with a Shimera softbox on it. So we'll go over a few things in the, in the, the classic grip case. First off is the standard baby pin, 5 eighths, standard of the industry, can be mount, mounted anywhere, floor, wall, ceiling, and holds fixtures and lights um, to mount anywhere you need to. Basic power strip, four to six different outlets, allows you to run more fixtures than one out of one separate um, outlet. Save space, you mount more. Basic light dimmer. Uh, basically, it's a small rheostat and mounted in a box, mounting one end to the power source, plugging your fixture to the other side, and you have a way to vary the, the power to your light source by just using uh, the rheostat inside the box. Lights dimmer or brighter. Here we have various types of clamps uh, from the standard pony clamp, A clamp, whatever you want to call it. Um, it does everything from holding uh, curtains up, holding diffusion up, clamping together clothing um, for talent. Comes in various sizes. And we have the standard clothespin, which has, a, again, a thousand and one uses. Good for holding diffusion, gels on, a, on barn doors. Uh, in the industry, it is referred to as the C-47, which no one knows why, but that's what it's called. Next, we have black wrap. Um, essentially, ex very expensive black aluminum foil. It's very thick. And it's flat black as to not reflect light. Um, again, something that has a lot of uses from uh, making instant emergency snoots for lights to actually making waterproof rain hats for fixtures that are outside and starts to rain. Um, it can keep heat sh as a heat shield to keep the heat from lamps, from burning carpets, drapes, whatever, um, as a protectant. Again, just another piece of equipment that has lots of uses and people find use for it every day. Um, but very handy to always have at least one roll um, of black wrap in your, in your kit. Here we have what's not commonly called stingers in the industry, but known as um, extension cords. Um, the heavier the better. 12-3 basically being uh, a standard 12-gauge wire with three wires in here, one grounded and two for the uh, hot and cold side. Here we have a gobo head, another piece of equipment that has a thousand and one uses. Um, it can hold half inch shafts, three inch shafts, and some even have can go down as small as a quarter inch um, or three eighths. This attaches to a, a, a gobo arm and or to a C-stand which allows it to have a lot of functionality, um, tilting this way and tilting this way. So you have a lot of control over the piece of equipment that you want to hang off this, whether it be a flag, a piece of diffusion, um, uh, a scrim, or whatever. Uh, again, another piece of equipment that has a lot of uses and it has a lot of different um, applications. Next we have the Mayfer clamp. 
which is somewhat like the gobo head, except it doesn't, it isn't typically made to work with a, and go on a C-stand. This has a, a multi-uses as a clamp to clamp on uneven or round surfaces. It could clamp on something that's round in here. It can clamp on something square. If it's just the lip of something, it can grab onto it and you can lock it down. And it'll hold extremely securely. This once this grabs onto something, it's very secure. Um, they have the capability of mounting a, a baby pin, a typical five eighths baby pin like the other one that was on the small platform. Again, once this is mounted somewhere, this can be clamped somewhere, and you can hang a fixture off it. You can hang a gobo head off it, um, running your diffusion or grids or uh, silks to diffuse the light. Another very versatile piece of equipment, um, has a lot of uses. So that's the essentials of, of a basic grip kit. There are a lot of other things you can use uh, that are handy, a uh, pocket knife, uh, definitely a flashlight, small set of screwdrivers, but essentially this will get you through most situations. Uh, you need to improvise a lot of times on the fly, emergency comes up, you need to fix it quick. With the basics here, you can get by with most anything.